Who better to set a Goonie up with than Rose from Titanic? Labor Day, directed by Jason Reitman, starring Kate Winslet as Adele and Josh Brolin as Frank. Now, in this movie, Kate Winslet's character Adele is a single mother with her son Henry, played by Gatlin Griffith, and they meet up with this fugitive, Frank, played by Josh Brolin, who's wanted for murder. And this movie is set in the 1980s. You can tell this is in the 1980s, but it's because Henry is playing with this, this small 1980s uh, art, arcade game of, uh, I think it's Donkey Kong or Pac-Man, something like that. And their home has records, vinyl to listen to for music. And the Bill Peters, there's a scene where the boy goes to the library and he has to use the old-fashioned card catalog instead of a, of a computer to look up a book. So that's how you can tell it's the 1980s. Also, the boy has an ET poster on his wall. And this movie is very good. I really did like this movie. Kate Winslet and Josh Bowen have great chemistry, and the boy works great with both actors. Clark Gregg is in the movie. It's a Coulson as Gerald. He is Kate Winslet's ex-husband. He was very good. And James Vanderbeek from Dawson Creek makes an appearance. J.K. Simmons makes an appearance in this movie as well. And Tobey Maguire makes an appearance in this movie. I really did like this movie. I like the, the fact that uh, Frank was like a second father to the boy. And I liked how Kate Winslet and Josh Brolin's characters got, got along and everything. And I also like that Clark Gregg's character was not made to look like a, a bad father. He did. He was a guy that actually did truly care about his son. So I'm gonna give this movie a B. Definitely check this one out.